Hey guys, what's up? Inazola back again today with another video. Today we're going to be talking about potential movesets for Porygon Z. Porygon Z is absolutely busted. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. It is such a good Pokemon. I haven't even used one yet, but I've been... I've faced... I have the unfortunate uh, time of uh, facing a few, so... Um, yeah, I'm just... Let's talk about Porygon Z, guys. But before we begin, let me remind you to hit that subscribe button. Helps you stay connected to the channel, stay up to my latest content. Holding a contest to give away two free shiny Larvitars. They're not perfect, but you know, they're legit shinies. So if you want legit shinies on your game that uh, are legit, not hacked, so you, if you're interested in that, you can join the contest on the channel. But yeah, let's begin. Porygon Z. So we're going to talk about a couple of double sets Okay, first, okay? If you're interested in singles, stay, stay tuned for later. But yeah, first, Porygon Z. Life Orb with adaptability is what you're going to see 99% of the time. So, um, most of them are running Hyper Beam, Dark Pulse, Thunderbolt, and Protect. I know you're think what you're thinking. Hyper Beam? That move's garbage. You have, to sit, you have to sit around waiting for a whole turn afterwards after you use it. But, your partner Pokemon here is Clefairy. Or you can use some other follow me Pokemon. I just think Clefairy is the best because people are going to try to target Porygon Z with a fighting move. Clefairy resists that. So you max out your hit points, max out your defense with a Violet. Your tanky hits so good. So what you do is you go follow me and redirect fighting moves onto the Clefairy. Clefairy doesn't care about those. Porygon Z just drops a ma big old max strike on the next Pokemon. Now you're probably faster than the other two Pokemon, um, unless it's like contrary or something, but that's kind of rare. Um, most contrary Pokemon are slow anyways, there's no superior in the meta right now, so don't need to worry about that. But yeah, max uh, max strike, you're dropping things speed, hitting like a freaking truck. Um, yeah, you can uh, go for Dark Pulse, which turns into max darkness, which also drops special defense. And Thunderbolt, just for like coverage on like those bulky waters, like Primarina, Toxapex, and stuff like that. It's just good to have uh, that kind of coverage. I think it's more valuable than Ice Beam, so yeah. And like, Ice Beam with the uh, Max Hail Storm is going to be summoning Hail and it's going to be damaging you, so it's not the most ideal, so yeah, Thunderbolt is what I would do. Um, just protect to like, protect your Porygon. In case like Clefairy goes down and you have to send something else in, you might target your Porygon Z and then you have, yeah, whatever, stuff like that. Um, this uh, Clefairy is just there to support Porygon Z. You can go for Hill Pulse, that's a gleam in case you get taunted and protect and stuff, so yeah, it's not, it's not a Clefairy video, it's a Porygon Z video. So yeah, that is basically the first Porygon Z set. Um, next up is a Weakness Policy set, and <coughs> sorry, excuse me, Weakness Policy uh, Porygon Z is a lot more high risk, high reward than the other one, because, um, <coughs> sorry, excuse me, because, um, you don't really have something to redirect um, uh, fighting attacks away from Porygon, so what you do is you hope you're the fastest thing on the field with Exelgore and Porygon Z. You drain punch yourself with Exelgore's bad attack stat and zero IVs. You're not hitting yourself very hard, so that's nice. You proc your own weakness policy. Now you uh, start max striking, max darknessing, and hailstorming if you want to. Just put that as like another coverage option. Also, you can you have access to Psychic and Psyshock too. So, if you're interested in that, if you're afraid of priority, or if you're afraid of uh, fighting types like Conkeldur, uh, <coughs> Max Mindstorm is not a bad option. It also removes any priority, and you're not running any priority, so that's nice. What you could do is also go for Protect first turn while Exelgore goes for Yawn or final gambit and just takes out the Pokemon that's most threatening to Porygon Z, so but that way, um, this way you don't have any um, way of proccing your policy unless your uh, opponent does for you, but you don't really want that because a close combat or a max knuckle is gonna hurt. So yeah. Next up is Assault Vest. This is more for singles, but you can use it in doubles too. It's uh, got the download ability instead of adaptability. I, didn't, I never, never explained adaptability. What adaptability does is it boosts your stab moves, so normal type moves in Porygon Z's case by 50% more, whereas the norm, normal, uh, eh, sorry, 
Um, normally, stab gives you an extra 50%, but and now it gives you it doubles your uh, attacking power pretty much. So, yeah. With uh, this download, it gives you a 50% uh, attack or special attack boost based off of um, the po opposing Pokemon's defense stats. So in, in doubles, it's not not terrible either. So because your opponent's gonna be having two Pokemon, it'll just pick one of them randomly. So yeah, you generally want to get a special attack boost because you're not a physical attacker. So it's kind of a toss up. Um, but it's better for singles rather than doubles because um, you can come in if you don't get the boost you want. You can still do some decent damage. You can switch out, get the boost you want later against a different Pokemon. So, yeah, Assault Vest is just Tri Attack, Thunderbolt, Dark Pulse, and Psy Shock. Just good coverage for Porygon Z. And I've explained what all those moves do when you're Dynamax. So, yeah, that's kind of boosting your special defense from a measly 95 to around 140 something. So, yeah, you're um, pretty bulky on the special side, and with the uh, base 85 hit points, you're, you're 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 hitting pretty tanky levels right there. It's just your physical hits aren't going to be too well, especially with fighting types. All right, and last up but not least, uh, Focus Sash Nasty Plot with download. If you get the correct uh, download boost, you're getting plus three special attack in one turn if you go Nasty Plot first turn. So basically, Nasty Plot against something tanky, you um. Yeah, just do that, and they might do some damage to you or status you, but um, at least you'll be able to live an attack. Um, then you try attack, or max strike, or dark pulse, or max darkness, or thunderbolt, or max lightning. Just all depends on what you, uh, what you want. And again, you can change those moves out for other things. But yeah, Porygon Z, absolutely busted Pokemon. Um, especially with Dynamax, just it Oko's Pokemon that it shouldn't Oko neutrally with Max Strike. It's ridiculous. I I don't like facing it. <laughs> but yeah, that is it for the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, how do you guys like to run Porygon Z? Uh, let me know in the comment section below, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.